We have deep post position down there. Draymond has the ball, so he's definitely going to be four-dimensional chessing this play. It looks to me like he is going to feed the post. So if he feeds Looney in the post, then that should automatically trigger some kind of split cut where Draymond will come over here and set a pick for Steph. Let's see. There's the entry. Okay, there's the automatic. Draymond coming here. Steph is going to get this screen. And I haven't seen enough of the game to see what the Kings' official pick and roll defense is, but it looks like drop right now. Basically, the big is here. Of course, you're going to follow Steph over the screen. And you've got the big. It looks like they're in drop here. He's back here to contain, but that's not smart against Steph because he's getting the screen here. He's going to come and get the pass here. This is a lot of space to give Steph for shooting. So you know 100% he's going to shoot that if he has the chance. Oh, he actually backed off, which is not at all recommended when you have Steph Curry about to take a jump shot. All right, that is money. One last play here. This position is very similar to the very last play, and it looks like Steph is going to enter the ball in to Looney, but why would he do that? He's not in the normal position in this basic split cut. You have Ismore here, and so is Ismore going to come all the way over here and set the screen for Steph? I mean, that, that could work fine. Split cuts can go either way. So they're running at each other, and you would think, oh, Bazemore's going to come here and put the screen on Steph because Steph gets paid more money. But actually, it's looking much like Steph is going to be the one to set the screen for Bazemore. And that is exactly what happens. There's their superstar setting his screen for the journeyman. But they're pals, so it's cool. Bazemore does not continue with the cut. I think Bays could have actually had an open jump shot if he kept the faith there. He could have continued all the way over to here. The big is sagging way back again. Maybe Bazemore is not feeling it as a catch and shooter. Draymond is over here. He's got his own four dimensional idea about what should be happening. I mean, he is open, but he's open for a reason. So Looney has a really tiny guy guarding him. So I think I missed the beginning of the play and there must have been some kind of screens and everyone got mixed up because the big was on Steph and the small's on Looney. The Kings are pretty much daring Looney to ISO this. I don't think they switched on purpose, but the situation is begging Looney to ISO the small. Nice spin move. And whoa, he finishes between two guys. That was dedicated. Good job, Kaban.